Hey guys, this is Chess Fanatic back with another game. Now, this is a funny game. Uh, the reason why I'm going to show you in a bit. All right, so a regular opening for most of the people, nothing really substantial to it. So I'm not trying to um, gain a lot of ground in the middle. Maybe that's a mistake, but uh, I'm just trying to open up, like uh, get all the pieces out. That's uh, one of the main things I try to do in the start of the game. So at this point, um, now I'm trying to take his uh, knight here and he plays a very nice move where he can actually get my knight as well. So I was thinking of one up, but he plays a nice move as well. But at this particular point, I missed the checkmate. I could have just gone ahead because I had this uh, um, what a, a bishop here and I could, could have just gone this one and uh, there was a checkmate, there was a game. But I missed it and I tried attacking the bishop he realizes that he made a mistake and he eventually tries to you know uh, get my bishop that's okay we still have good position because we have uh, this file attacking the king so it, it might actually just work out for us just uh, fine let's just see so I'm trying to progress at this point and uh, this guy's trying to uh, make an attack here as well so I try to bring up my knight uh, towards his side just try to you know um, just unsettle him maybe entice him into making a mistake here all right so I'm also thinking about this file here he might actually you know uh, some sometime in the future he might actually move try to move this one and forget about this and this right so I'm, I'm trying to keep this uh, queen here on this file as well just so that you know Right, I bring my knight back because I'm just trying to unsettle him and see if he makes a mistake there or not. Right, so we want some extra firepower on this side so that we can attack the queen and the king as well. That's the reason why I'm bringing the rook here. But I know this position here at this point uh, right now, this is a little bit weak and he could actually try and break free. So we have to keep some level of protection on this side as well. But anyway, hopefully I'm trying to, you know, add some more pressure and we don't really have to get to that. So White is a little bit, you know, smart. He is uh, doing that. Now I was waiting for this one. Uh, so I was uh, like, just like I said, I was waiting for this one. So he does make that mistake and now we can take his knight. All right. Uh, the, these kind of things only happen in low level players. Uh, I'm definitely sure. If somebody's a high level player, they would actually pick this up and not make that mistake. But, you know, there's some benefits of playing with low level players just like me. I mean, I'm not a very high level player either. Just 1000 rating. Anyway, so this was probably a mistake uh, by me because uh, now uh, he could try to attack my queen. I, I will have to th bring the queen somewhere else, right? And uh, then my knight is hanging. So probably a mistake uh, by me at this time and uh might not that's that's really why i just take it back all right now the problem is at this point that he has you know this pawn up here then there's like a couple of rooks here so it's not looking very good at the moment so i bring my knight here just so that uh, the pawn does not really progress a little bit more and there's some extra protection and cushion here as well so uh, he's trying to attack this knight as well. I'm not looking. The position for me is not looking very good at the moment. So extra buffer for the knight, right? And sometimes you know you can use uh, uh, the enemy's pawns like protection as well. So because this rook can't really attack directly from this side because there's a pawn. So there's a benefit to having uh, the enemy's pawn uh, up your field. <laughs> Uh, you know what I mean anyway so now again a very uh, difficult situation here so what I can do is I can try to attack because I can't really save uh, this knight here okay so I have to sacrifice it luckily what we can do is we can sacrifice like <coughs> So luckily what we can do is we can sacrifice in a way that uh, we can take his queen as well. If he goes for a sacrifice, he does take his queen. 
Now, I would have liked to have some extra backup to take uh, this rook here as well, but we can't really do that. But now we have an opening towards this king, which I'm gonna use. So this is where he makes a mistake. He should have just gone ahead and taken my rook because his king was really open and we get the checkmate and we win. So this is a very close game. I could have won it earlier, but uh, due to that mishap, he actually had to recover and get the game afterwards. But still, I was lucky to just win the game. So that uh, chess fanatic, Alchev and I thank you for listening and watching.